okay, I think that Facebook share is going to cross 200, right? What I'll do is I will sell put, I'll collect the $3.25 premium multiplied by 100, so that's $325 for every one contract of 100 shares that I sell. And I will bet that the price will go up, but I entered at this $160 strike. On 15th of May, if Facebook really hits, let's say, even if it doesn't hit 220, 230, it is still hovering at 175, 177, 180, right? Or let's just say it drops a bit. It drops to 167, but my strike, the strike that I enter is 160. 15 of May, nothing happens to me. I get to keep the $325 that I collected today when I enter into this trade. So what I will do is I will sell my option to collect premium, okay, at 250, but then at somewhere around 250, uh, 252, 253, or two, even 255, I will buy back an option so that my risk is limited to the $5. And if, let's say, I sell the option premium for, let's say, uh, in this case, I think it's $2 something, I'm only losing to something instead of losing the full amount. Okay, so what does that mean on a trade basis is that I will, I've already put this out, I will sell, uh, this is minus one, I will sell a call option at 250 because I believe in my chart here that 250 is a, is a, is a, is a price that I'm willing to bet against.